This video is about ChatGPT, but not on a generic topic. Most of you already know what is ChatGPT and how it works, but this video is a bit different. I'm going to explain what is perspective prompting. This framework can broaden your understanding and provide a more comprehensive view of the topic at hand, which can help you make more informed decisions and have a more nuanced understanding of complex issues. There are two different prompt formula use cases, singular perspective, multiple perspectives. In singular perspective, this is where we want to do something like, please write a topic about a perspective from the viewpoint of one singular viewpoint. In multiple perspectives, we'd ask such as, please write an argument for or against a specific topic from multiple diverse perspectives. I want you to include the names and points of view of each different perspective and the viewpoints should be the following. So let's now hop into examples of each perspective. So prompt number one is, please write about improving as a kickboxer from the perspective of a kickboxing coach. And there you have it. We have advice on establishing a strong foundation, focus on conditioning, train with purpose, sparring and partner work, mental strength and visualization, and learn from experience and seek feedback from the perspective of an expert such as kickboxing coach. This is great because you can use ChatGPT to learn complex topics and understand a specific perspective from different fields of view. But the cool part is that we can ask the same prompt from a different perspective. So I asked, please write about improving as a kickboxer from the perspective of a human anatomy expert. Now ChatGPT will break this specific topic down, but from a physical standpoint. We're talking about biomechanics and kinetic chain, core strength and stability, lower body power generation, upper body mechanics, joint health and injury prevention, flexibility and range of motion, and recovery and rehabilitation, seeing it from a completely different perspective. So you can use this for an endless amount of different topics and really develop a well-rounded field of view on that specific topic by seeing it from different perspectives. Now let's move on to our multiple point of view prompt. So I asked ChatGPT, please write an argument against genetically modified organisms, GMOs, that considers multiple perspectives. Include the names and points of view of the different perspectives, such as a farmer, a consumer, and a geneticist. And similar to our first style of singular prompting, this is going to give us now multiple styles but on one single prompt. So we have a perspective from a farmer, from a consumer, and from a geneticist, on the same exact topic but from extremely different points of view. So this is an incredibly cool prompting strategy that you can use to better understand your audience, your clients, or even just better the world around you.